Hi guys, Dr. Sammy here. Thanks for joining us for our little bark box venture. Uh, so far, the only thing we've done is cut the tape so I don't have to bite it off as we're opening this thing. <laughs> and here we go for our next bark box. Woo! -na 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 -na. Oh, I like this one. That's cool. <laughs> we got a Jurassic Park. We get some little dinosaurs going on. That's cool. Now there's some new movies. All right. Bark and Jurassic World have teamed up for an adventure 65 million years in the making. In dog years, that is. Really, really long ago. To celebrate, we've brought you dog a cargo of our favorite dinosaurs. Nothing could possibly go wrong from here. So prepare to be amazed, pups. Makes me think of Paw Patrol. Pups, here we come. Our first one, dun, dun, dun. we get a nice little scrunchie. Blue, looks kind of like a Velociraptor. We'll see what he is. He's large, 50 plus pounds. This is for your 50 plus dogs, not your Chihuahua. It's as big as your Chihuahua. <laughs> and what is our name? Beta. Beta is ready to lead your pack into playtime. <laughs> Time to find out who's the alpha dog around here. Woof. <laughs> so that was kind of cool. I like that one. Oh, squeaky head. We get a squeaky head. <laughs> All right, cool. There's our first one. Fun little Velocal Raptor. This one looks blue and fluffy. <clears throat> ah, the one that looks like an ostrich that I don't know the name of. <laughs> that guy, the bird looking thing. 50 plus pounds again. Our technical name is Therizonosaurus. The furry feathered herbivore could use a pet picture. Squeeze that deep grunting squeaker and hear me roar. <laughs> so this is the feathered one. That's kind of cool. If for those of you who are interested in it, there was actually a very interesting Chinese study a while back with Chinese archeologists where they found a layer of dinosaurs and one of them they thought they had feathers on. <clears throat> um, hence they came up with feathered dinosaurs. Uh, some other research that's more updated that involves CTs and MRIs uh, goes into a little more details on that for those of you who are a little more interested. So that's cool, but all right. <laughs> all right, let's see what we got next. And we get an orange, dun, 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 dun. I don't know if he's the T-Rex or another version of a Velociraptor because he looks like he has fuzzy wings. Looks like he has a foot for a tail. <laughs> All right, this guy is for our medium to large dogs, about 20 plus pounds or 10 kilograms. Pyroraptor. I've never heard of a pyroraptor. So a pyroraptor is a furry feathered style in straight fire. This pyroraptor might get hot tempered so let your pup get their squeaks in while they can. All right, so I think my interpretation is a smaller version of the Velociraptor. That's kind of cool. Oh gosh, that's really squeaky. <laughs> and for the goodies in the bag. Oh cool, they got some other like swimmers in there. Well, these are just pictures, not actually in the box. They got the flying ones. They got a Mr. DNA. That's a Jurassic Park thing. They have the T-Rexes. Yeah, they got some other goodies. So if you all order some, maybe you'll get some of the other ones. Please share. Ah, and our box just fell on the floor. Sorry. Ah, for our Raptor Scrappers. Scraps. Present Raptor Scraps. Cool. Soft baked biscuits in little dinosaur footprint shapes. That's appropriate. That's cool. Next, same thing, different flavor. This particular flavor is with apples, meaty jerky. This one was with veggies. So you get your veggie dog and you get your meaty dog. <laughs> Preference. And then our good old fashioned pork stick recipes, the good old just choose um, what dog or dinosaur dog wouldn't like this. So cool. 
here you go guys. This is our uh, dinosaur bark box for the month. Hope y'all enjoy it and congratulations to whoever wins. Thanks for everything y'all do and we'll see you uh, next time. Bye guys.